I'm unavailable. They know they see me. I'm unavailable. They know they see me. So, guys, uh, let's review David O's concert yesterday, fat festival yesterday at uh, Atlanta City State Farm Arena, sold out 21,000 capacity. Well, David O did it again. Atlanta is like uh, David O's second city, you know, after Lagos, Atlanta, you know. That's where he grew up. He has a lot of friends there. So it is expected of him to sell out that city because that's his second uh, home. It is expected of David Doe to sell out any show in Atlanta. And he decided to start organizing a festival. This festival will be occurring every year, every year, every year. So it's like uh, David O's festival, just like a uh, Drake festival in the uh, in uh, in Canada. Every year it happens. It brings a lot of uh, artists all around the world, and uh, David O brought a lot of uh, a lot of uh, musicians there. Some of you might argue that oh, David O wasn't able to sell it alone. It's so it's, he, he was selling it alongside other uh, artists. No, 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 no. Don't use that word at all. This is David O's festival. His face, front banner of that festival. The only thing you can see by the side is the name. You see Mayor Coast name, you see King Promise, you see Victoni, you see King Spesh, all those uh, musicians just around it, if you, if you look it well. Well, the show was completely sold at 21,000 capacity, and David O made us understand that as at yesterday, yesterday, the tickets were selling out for as high as $2,000 per person. That's what you get now. When you are getting uh, uh, more than uh, 10 artists inside one package, you should be able to pay $2,000 US dollars now. The initial price was as low as uh, 100 or something dollar, but towards the end Towards the show, ticket were sold at two thousand US dollars. I don't know if it was resale ticket or it was ticket actually sold by Davido himself. Well, they know how this market goes, so they know how to make their own money. The way show was packed, twenty one thousand capacity. Do not allow anybody to tell you anything about that show, or maybe the show wasn't packed. The show was packed. One of the highlights of that show was uh, when uh, Choma came in and uh, tried to support uh, her husband, David O. You know, it was really, really great to see Choma finally coming out to show herself off uh, to the crowd. You know, you know what happened to Choma, you know the, the bad memories and everything. And now she's really, really happy to have welcomed twins. So she was there to support her husband, to be there for her husband. And people were really expecting her to be there. 
Choma is currently in USA ever since she gave birth. You know, she just stay there chill for Atlanta and leave those house. So it's great, guys. It's really, 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 really great to see Choma uh coming out of her own shell, you know, after the whole incident, Choma just decided to go pen one side, you no know, allow anybody once here. And talking about the show generally, eh, you know, when Rema did this O2 Arena show, I was so hyped about that show, you know, I was crazy, going crazy about it because that was a, really the first time I actually seen Rema uh perform in a very massive stage. David has been doing it for a long time and honestly speaking, eh, I'm not even about to compare any artists. David Doe did his thing. That's exactly how David Doe usually uh, does his show. Incredible and nice and uh, smooth and good. And uh, May, of course, also did his thing. King Promise as well. King Vic Victoria and so many other artists who came also did, did their own thing. So, Well, they all did their own thing, uh, Mayo Cool and every other entertainer was there. The show was great generally, because of the videos I was seeing there. And people were in there, kind of like trying to make issues out of it. The show was sold out, 21,000 capacity or even more. It was sold out, sold completely out. Even State Farm, the State Farm Arena on their official page acknowledged the public that the show was sold out. So. A state farmer I ran at us said the place was uh, the, the show was sold out. So who are you? Who is in Nigeria? Uh just uh, because you had the opportunity to go on the phone and tweeting that the show wasn't sold out. And meanwhile you were in there, you know if you will get visa to travel. Go Kutunu here. <laughs> there you can tell if a show was sold out in USA, Atlanta City. Come on, man. That show was sold out. I was also so happy oh, to see oh, almost everybody that was there were completely dark skinned black Americans. Honestly, guys, we are the white folks now. Because I was told in Atlanta, you will see mostly black, uh, uh, black people. You can just stand in the center of uh, any place in Atlanta and shout, Are you not there now? And somebody somewhere will answer you, I did fine. Are you there, brother? Yes. That's to tell you how Nigerians have uh, the Nigerians and Africa, other African nation own Atlanta cities, majorly from for uh, for blacks. That is where they get their own comfort as as uh, as uh, as blacks. You know, majorly. So it is it is indeed normal to see everybody, almost everybody that that came to that show were just dark skin, and it's good to see how they are supporting their own. Eh? It's good to see how they are supporting their own. David O's father was also there as well. David O's dad was there. <laughs> he was there to support uh, David O. That was really, really crazy. I wasn't even expecting that. Like I've said, Choma was also there. David O's uh, cousins were there. And everyone was there. It was David O's show. It's David O's concert. It's David O's festival. And it will be happening every year. David O's festival. That's it, guys. David O's show. So, I don't want to hear pimp from someone. If you start checking comments to see how people are reacting to it, uh, you will be so mad. Someone saying, oh, David O, someone said, no, said David O didn't sell it, sell, sold out that uh, venue all along. It was a festival. It was, uh, he, he sold it alongside other artists. So, if it was only him, I don't think he would have been able to 
um, sell it out. Come on, man. Now David do show. Now David do festival. It doesn't mean nothing. Everything went great. Everything was smooth. Uh, the performer was great. I, I've, I've not seen anybody complain about the performance, though. Uh, it's just the opposite fans who are busy, not happy, because you know now it's just it's just the comparison uh, syndrome that is in most Nigerians' fans. Stop comparing. Just be happy for uh, for for Davido. The same way uh, in this guy.